So Roberto Cameron then with 12 points for the replay here. And Islam Timoziev, his pressing style. And uh, personally, I believe that Cameron is making a tactical mistake here. He picked up a count in the uh, second round, but it doesn't count for more than a single point. Good finish for Camarel. Round three. And it's still not too late here for Camarel to come back and uh, make a big difference. Well, Camarel knocks the, the gap down to four points. Well, he never got hit there, but the point went the Russians' way, which so often happens. Another non-punch from Timurziev, and he gets a point. And I've got to wonder whether Camrell's got any better since I first saw him um, moons ago. 26 years of age now. I think I saw him more. It doesn't matter when, but uh, it doesn't have to have improved that much. Well, a big gap now has opened up here. Seven points. So Cameron not only won't make the semis, he will lose his number one European ranking. Whether that actually goes to Timurziev remains to be seen. I doubt very much they'll swap places from six to one and one to six. They may put to Timurziev. Oh, lovely right hand. Terrific punch there, Camrell on the floor in round three. That was a terrific punch from Timurziev. Unfortunately, the bell has stopped any further action here. Big lead, though, for the Russian. We'll see that knockdown in a second. It was a cracking right hand. And there it is. Smack on the chin. So Roberto Camarel, the Italian, on the deck in round three. As we come out now for the fourth round. Don't forget, not just the European ranking at, at stake here, but the place in the semi-final and the medal stage. And Roberto Camarel, the favourite coming in, is going out. Ten points behind. Only a knockout will do. And the Russians are so supreme in European boxing. As I say, in world terms, they're second to the Cubans. The United States have gone... Uh, way way downhill in fact since the 1992 Olympic Games where they just got one gold medal albeit a good one in Oscar De La Hoya and a one uh, in 96 in Atlanta that was Reed didn't get any of course uh, in Sydney Russians and Cubans dominating world boxing currently. And Timurziev must think it's birthday and Christmas all in one here. He's got a massive 16 point lead. Half a minute to go. And if he can take a, a whack, he's uh, in the semi final. 
and could be in with a big chance of winning a gold medal. It's up the super heavyweight class, of course, plus 91 kilograms. Less than 10 seconds to go now, and Camarel in the red is going out. Lost his number one ranking, and that's a cracking win for Istan Tenoziev of Russia. A minimum of a bronze medal. Stares him in the face now. And Roberto Camarel, well, he was a major disappointment, losing that by 15 points. I don't think Tua Zev can quite believe this. Well, there you are. Tua Zev declared the winner. But you're going to join us next time for the semi-final action from Plovdiv.